<laughs> I'm dead. Maybe it's this. Oh, it's gonna start already, huh? Shoot. It's already there. Yeah, yeah. And Ashley Hetherington started a video. CC. Here we are. Hello, everyone. Guys, hello, welcome. Hello. This is a different live for us, right? <laughs> yeah. It's different. She different. Because we just had Bible study and we're like, we want to go live and talk with the girlies. Also, we haven't gone live together. Can we, in how long? In a minute. It's been a minute. Oh my Someone gosh, got sister baptized. got baptized. Praise Come the Lord. On. Myla is here. <laughs> All y'all, praise the Lord. Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is my sweet sister, Cece. She's amazing. And I just love her. She's amazing. But we just wanted to hop on and just speak truth and yeah. share just from our hearts, like mm -hmm. just a little bit, hear from y'all. Cece already got something. Like, I Cece just already got something. I just am thinking about our dreams. Oh! I know, I know. <laughs> and then the power of telling someone about our dream. Wow. I just think that there's a lot there and. Yeah. Maybe, maybe that's you on the other side of this right now and you're someone that has had a dream but maybe has pushed it away or maybe you're like, I don't remember the last time that I dreamed. Yeah. And I think it's so powerful. We were just in small group and you had asked that question of what are you being obedient in right mm. now in this season? What's yeah. the Lord calling you to be obedient in? And um, yeah. I think that there's more to that, but I don't know if you want to... No, that's, that's good. That's really good. Keep going. Yeah, okay. I was like, no, um, yeah. I, so I don't know. I just think the coolest thing, there has been so much favor and fruit that has oh, been yeah. upon this woman right mm. here. And y'all know it because you found her likely like Drop a heart if you have found her this year. Aww. Like if you have started following Ashley in this, this 2022, if you have found her. Um, I have had the honor of knowing her for a year and a half now and just witnessing and hearing her talk about so many of these dreams that are now coming into fruition mm. in real time yeah, is the crazy. coolest freaking thing to see. Like, I feel like I should be paying the big bucks to be watching front row to yeah. literally seeing her dreams quite like actually come true and it's not that she hit the lotto or anything like that but you all it's things that she has been so detailed in praying for yeah. and I want to say that because I think so often the world can say like oh and I think this is why we actually shy away from dreams it's because the world paints this visual that yeah. we aren't actually allowed to dream because we should just be content with oh. what we have right now like we, we why why dream you know and I think that is a lie from the enemy. It's yeah. a lie. I think that we get to dream. Yeah. Like the God wants us to dream. He delights when we dream. And it is so cool to witness yeah. like a best friend dream, pray over those dreams, and mm. then watch them come into fruition. Yeah. And I say that because I think so often we're like, okay, well, I, I'll dream it. I'll pray it. I'll say it. And then it just won't happen. Yeah. And are you actually believing for it? Are you having the faith for it? Wow. I think that yeah. is just like, that's the question, you know? Because so mm. often we'll, we'll say it or, and then we'll shy away from it. Why? Because a lack of belief. Yeah. And I say that not to condemn anybody, but just to remind us, myself, like, am I believing the things that I'm dreaming for, you mm. know? And believing that God is going to show up in those ways. So, yeah. Um, Come I on. Know. I just need some people up in here to increase their belief and just start dreaming again yeah like i don't know who needed permission but let this be it like start dreaming again start yeah. partnering with god in yeah. those dreams and then being like consistent i don't know a more consistent human <laughs> actually oh. being consistent about praying over those dreams every day you know every freaking day i mean if y'all saw backstage passes to her prayer wall and her vision board and 
So I how she it. lives her life, uh, it's Thank no accident you, you get to witness some of the fruit. Um, and so unfortunately, true. social media doesn't allow you to see all of it, but it's a whole lot because she's been praying, because she's been believing, and because she has a whole lot of faith. Oh, so Cece, I'm you're just, so sweet. I literally am just speaking the truth right now. Well, okay. It's really powerful because oh. when you have friends hey, y'all, that here. you, <laughs> when you on. have friends that you're also able to speak these dreams out to, it's yeah. even more real. Like God, I just think like if you have something on your heart, you shouldn't just keep it between you. You need to tell a sweet friend. Like yes. we literally... Cece and I were talking about some of these things that are just now coming into fruition a year and a half ago. A year and a half ago. It's I was so with wild. her when we were talking about her podcast. Like so we were literally, I remember it so clear as day. We were walking, at, like we were walking after working together and you were like, I think God's leading me to start this. Yes. Podcast. Oh my gosh. And I remember that. I was like, like, in front of the W still. But she told me, you know, and that took vulnerability. Yeah. Because you aren't fully sure. Like, if we we're fully sure about everything, then we didn't, wouldn't need God, right? That's, like, the faith part. Yeah. We're, we're, we're listening, and then we're having the faith to step into that thing. And that's so real. Yeah. That you need people to run alongside you, and you need people to tell. And even if it's as small as, like, writing it in the chat for the very first time. Yeah. Like. Come on. I'm just saying. We're going to increase our boldness right now, too. Wait, I love okay? that. Can somebody yes. do that over here right now? Please. Um, what's something that you are believing God for? Yeah. Tara just said that. Yeah. Like, that's such a good question to ask yourself. Yeah. And you know what? If you are fortunate enough to have a friend like that in your life, praise God for them mm -hmm. and then invite them to do the same thing. Maybe yeah. they haven't been aware of it yet or their attention hasn't been on that yet. And you get to be that friend that says, hey, I want to partner in my dreams with you. Like, can you be my accountability buddy in this? And saying that... You know, I'm telling, I'm going to say it out loud and then I'm going to pick a date, Aww. whatever that is. I think there's power in that too. Like what's the date? Pick the freaking date. Cause we can have dreams all day long. We don't set a date. We're, we'll be like, ah, in five, 10 years. Like, yeah, that's so true. Pick a freaking date that's from one so friend to another. True. Well, and I even said that the other day. I was like, well, in five years, that'd be really cool. And my brother yeah. was like, why in five years? I was like, whoo. <laughs> Dang. It got me in my, it just, it, it, it really stopped me in my tracks. That'll do it. That'll I love that. It. So literally y'all right now, this is an action step for all of y'all. Sorry if you can hear my dog, like literally chewing, chewing on a bone as we're talking, but I literally want you guys to just hear what Cece said and also listen to her podcast. Um, but seriously, like we need to be moving. Someone said this in the chat and I noticed it. They said, we need to co-labor with Christ. Mm. And God, he puts these things on your heart because he has a mission, right? So the podcast is actually God's idea. Oh, for, like, see, see, he just used Cece to bring his idea about. Right. And he's so kind to, to use us. Sorry yeah. about my dog. So like, whatever it is, just... What's okay? What's her podcast? What's her podcast? Uh, it's There's called That's podcast. Joy. That's Joy. Like that. That's Joy. That's what the podcast is called. It's literally so amazing. And I, I love just, that, Ash. That's good. And let's not just be like, let's actually look at what the Bible says because God always called people to mission. Mm -hmm. So let's look at that. Let's yeah. not actually just think that our job as Christians is to just go to church, read our Bibles, and you know, pray every day. God, those are good things. We should be doing those things, but God is going to commission you out to do things in his name because he wants, he, he wants to make this world more like him. Yeah. What's Cece's Instagram account? At C <laughs> Colbanero. That's C C A L B O N E R O. Somebody type it in the chat, would ya? No, she's here. No, Oh my gosh, Crystal and Rainy was here. The live the community OGs. is here. OGs. Dang. Y'all, thanks for hanging Come out. On. 
go check out CC Girls podcast. You want to say it one more time for the people who maybe yeah, didn't hear? Yeah, so my podcast is called That's Joy. You can find me on Instagram at That's Joy the Podcast. And then um, my personal Instagram is at C-C-A-L-B-O-N-E-R-O. Y'all, find good friends who you can yes. just run alongside with. Um, oh my gosh. Oh. Rainy, you're so sweet. That's so kind. Y'all are amazing. I'm Rainy, drop Rainy. your hat. Rainy, girl, we see you. Rainy, you're a real one. Rainy's a <laughs> for real one. Oh, guys. Yeah, she DM'd me the kindest thing. I love guys, her. follow so Rainy sweet. too. She's just amazing. Honestly, honestly. At Rainy, two N's, underscore Marie, underscore. So that's, go follow her. All right, y'all. Thank you, Jesus, for this time. I just, also, we're just so grateful that we get to talk to you guys together. That's, like, really stinking cool. No, it's so cool. So, so cool. It's such a gift. Um, If you guys enjoy Ashley's content, if you find a podcast that I have put out and you like it, it would mean the world if you shared anything with another friend. Because I think so much of what we get to do, praise God that we get to do it, is just make his name more known, you know? And so um, to hold that to ourselves. um, Anytime I get like a good book or a good podcast, like we'll send it to each other too. And be like, dude, you need to hear this. Fire. Yeah. Because we just want to bless each other in that same way that we feel as though we are getting blessed. Um, Amen. So just a little tidbit there. Love y'all. Bye. Bye, guys. Bye. Have a good day.